At one point in this movie, someone turns into a tube of toothpaste and gives a high school boy a full frontal facial. That's all you need to know about this movie. Sixty Million Dollar Man is a Stephen Chow comedy movie released in 1995. Its strongest asset is the practical effects. When he turns into a rice cooker, that's not CGI bullshit. They actually made a giant prop cooker. Computer graphic was only used sparingly, and although they don't look convincing at all, I think it actually adds to the overall charm of this movie. They knew the CGI wasn't the most convincing part, but it didn't matter. Because a movie about a guy who can turn into household items, eat batteries for dinner, and pee out of a shower head isn't meant to be taken seriously. The fake CGI, I think, works for its favor. In terms of plot, it's the simplest Stephen Chow format. Egotistic asshole gets a life-changing reality check that humbles him. His change of attitude gives him new meaning of life and great power to overcome obstacles, and defeats the big bad guy in the end. To be honest, the plot is only there to deliver the comedy, which Steven is so famous for. Although it's a movie from 30 years ago, the jokes age surprisingly well. I think the reason is because most of them are visual comedy, as opposed to relying on conversation or cultural references. So even for Western audience, they will still be able to enjoy the movie. Speaking of reference, at one point in the movie, they decided to inexplicably shoehorn a pop fiction dancing homage slash parody scene. This is a thing Stephen Chow loves to do. You see a lot of those in his movie. I just like to point that out. The music, cinematography, or editing range from okay to bad throughout the movie. But then again, those are not the thing you're here for. You're here for a laugh. Overall, I consider this a slightly above-average Stephen Chow movie. Best suited to watch with a couple of friends with a few beers on hand. Check it out if you can. And I'm giving this a five out of ten. Okay, um, this is the first movie review I do ever. Let me know if you want more. Let me know how I can improve. If you like this, why don't you give this a thumbs up? I'll probably do more in the future alongside with Jenga videos. Subscribe if you don't want to miss out on any. Until next time, cheers.